Sweet Town Square is a candy shop in Chardon Square where we really just wanted to focus on being the corner candy shop where you go to buy your little knickknacks and come here after school and just enjoy all the old fashioned candies but also your favorite candies of today. We were going kind of for like a Willy Wonka game board type situation. So when you come in, you're gonna hear music, you're gonna hear our airplane going, the choo-choo train's always going, and there are just always little sections that you can kind of lose yourself in and remember, you know, just what it's like to be a kid again. We really focus on the nostalgic old-fashioned candy. So you'll see behind me we have uh, the Necco wafers and then candy buttons and the classic wax candies. Um, we also really tried to get a feel for what our locals enjoy. So we, we've had requests for, you know, Nerds Ropes and Cadbury European candies. And then I, I also really want to focus on as many local candy makers as we can. So we carry the Humphreys type candies, the uh, Euclid Beach Taffies, um, we have local cotton candy makers. We also have the famous freeze-dried candies that everyone's been talking about lately. Um, we really like to try everything, but always keep the classics. And this is the first spot you see when you come in and they'll just immediately say, oh, I remember these, or I, for I totally forgot these were such a thing. Um, we also have these drawers that you're able to go into, so a lot of times they just love exploring. And I'll hear a drawer open, and a majority of the time the parents are more excited than the kids because you hear the parents say, I used to get these at a baseball game, or, you know, uh, my grandpa used to eat these. Our sodas have been growing exponentially in the past couple weeks we've been open. Uh, we started with just like a couple on the counter, and then as people are trying them, they want to try more. So we opted for, you know, we have the classic Coca-Colas and the Stewart's and the Dad's Root Beers, but uh, we also are opting into the really weird things like alien juice and uh, just odd things that you haven't really heard of before, but are kind of tempted to try. This is something that my husband and I have always wanted for our families and to be able to see other families come in and sort of enjoy, you know, things that we, it was just a dream six months ago. We, just, we spoke of it and we were like, what if someone could do this? And how excited would a kid be if they could open a drawer and find candy? And now being able to see it, it it's like, it's like every person that walks through the door is our family, which is really cool. It's, it's something that I never really imagined we would be doing. And now that we're able to do it, I feel like it's really a gift, not only to the community, but to ourselves as well.